Hello and welcome, I am Arumba. thank you for joining me. Let's play some more of our Poland Strong campaign. So good news, Brabant is coring Vizcaya. Nice. So we are getting down there. They are not having, they have not started coring this one yet. The 8 base tax with the important center of trade in the estuary. Naval force limit plus 5, holy crap. Wow, I had no idea that this thing was that good. War score cost is actually quite low. But, uh, yeah, good job, Brabant. They're going to be uh, pretty good. They do have some Protestant zealots sieging them down. I can't get there. They cored that thing, right? Ages ago, yeah. Oh, look at that. Religious zeal. It's already Protestant, so what are you guys sieging them for? You guys are crazy. Oh, whatever. We are at 62 out of 67 force limit. Basically, all I want to do right now is uh, we'll wait 13 months that our war exhaustion come down. 13 months from now, we can we can also take our next tech level. So we need to send some money off to Saxony. Not yet. We'll do it the second before we want to take the tech. Just so that the gift bonus lasts as long as possible. We can go down to no maintenance. Let's check on Rebellion. 3.2 years, 2.6. You got quite a bit of revolt risk. It's just spread out enough that it's not a big deal. Austria is the new papal controller. The way I see it, we're 63% of the way toward a free stability point. We have a good number of controlled cardinals. We should probably improve relations with the papal state again. Now that we're done with our war with them. As soon as January rolls around, I'm going to retract this diplomat. Just because we don't need to, don't need to keep him there all the time. And the reduced improved relations only happens on the tick on January. So. So what are we doing now? We are... Improving relations with Moldavia. Sure. We have no loans. We're making 20 ducats. A bit of inflation. Fair number of administrative points. And our modifier disappears what date? Here it is. May 24th. Okay, so that means that in May, we're going to want to send them the gift. That way, on June 1st, we'll get the Western Arms trade, and then we can pay for our tech. That seems good to me. Oh, right. We are no longer... Uh, no truce with Sweden. Let's embargo them. And we should probably go to war with Sweden, Sweden soon. Excellent supplies. Oh, that's good. There's our Western Arms trade. Increased narrow-minded expired. Lost a claim on something that I don't care about. And now we can take this for just 574. It's still not as low as we could get if we were Western, but it's pretty darn good. It's, le it's less than you'd normally pay for Western tech. So that also unlocks an idea group. Um, we probably should just take the military tech right now. Okay, we have decisions available. We can not form the Polish-Lithuanian Commonwealth because we have to have stability of one. But we can pass the Conventicle Act. More tolerance. And then reduced tolerance. So if we want to take increased stability cost, we can just have one more missionary strength. I think we just do all three of these decisions. That'll help us to convert once we inherit Lithuania. I don't think we need to feed Lithuania anymore. I think we're I think I'm ready to just double the size of our country. I think that that would be really good. 
I haven't put any thought yet into what our next idea group should be. But in order to get the achievement, and I'd like to get the achievement soon, we need to probably go for the increased... Um, what's it called? Something that's going to give us some more cavalry combat ability. See, quality would give us another 5% discipline on top of the, the 10 that we're already going to have. What else could we do? Well, first off, which technology are we the most behind on? Diplomatic technology. So I probably should not do a Diplo idea. The one we're actually the closest to being equal to time with is military, but that's only because we've been focusing on it for like 30 years. So I suppose we could actually take any idea group, really. Preferably not diplomatic. I think humanist is probably the way to go. It would help out a lot. It would also stack well with our Polish idea that reduces the accepted culture threshold. Gives us a lot more tolerance. I think we go for... Yeah, I think we go for humanist. And do we boost stability? No, we wait for overextension to go away first. Which will be done May of two years from now. Okay. So in two years, we might click the button. Also, we have to have an annoying 283 administrative points available to core this the second we click the button. We're also probably going to be way over the force limit. Because Lithuania is going to have... They have 60 regiments. Spain is no longer a valid rival. Well, apparently they clicked the button too, and they've just inherited Spain. Or they've created Spain. So before the Union could break, they actually formed it. And the fact that they have low autonomy means that they... Uh... Well, Aragon annexed Naples. But they inherited this, and so their autonomy is really low. Oh well. Okay, we have Rebellion coming up, and we have a bad embargo now, because Spain is not an eligible rival. I don't know why they're not. Yes, they are. Let's re-rival them. It might just be because they tag-switched that they stopped being eligible. What policies will we have? Ooh, I like this. Humanist offensive. Sweet. It's a good one. Okay. Well, we're not going to enable any, but... And the rebellion is the Wallachian nationalists. Muntenia. And that one's going to be converted never. How is it that we lost conversion speed? Probably because we're stability... Alright, let's just boost stability now. Maybe not. Can I wait? No, I just I just pay the points. I want it now. I want to get this thing converted. Oh, really? Still no nothing? Damn. No, I don't really want to pay for another one, do I? Okay, we're not going to take that decision quite yet. Oh, you know what it is? We lost the Inquisitor. That's why. Crap. So even if we boosted it further, could we still convert it? We've got negative five. This is something, okay. Paradox listened, or I don't know if they listened to me, or if they just took the obviously right decision to, to sum up the unrest value in a province. Please do it again here. You know, like, please. Instead of saying 0%, show me what the sum is. Like, why do I have to do the math? I hate that. I just hate it. Okay, so the negative modifiers are negative 5, and then we've got 2, 3, 4, 5, 
5.1. How on earth is that not 0.1% per month? It should be 0.1% per month. I'm not crazy. Alright, I'm gonna... I'm gonna... Ugh. This is gonna put off in integrating... Integrating Lithuania, just to get this damn thing converted. March you over there. Buy us a little bit of time. While we wait for... That should be at point one. Something, something squirrely going on with that math there. Well, our religious unity... Getting higher. Hey, you've got a little bit of legitimacy. That might help. Not this, but... Reduce the unrest, I mean. Let's actually park you here. It's the one that's got more revolt risk. Still, it's at 95%, so there's a pretty good chance it's going to fire. If there's any chance it can fire... You know what? This one's probably one that makes a lot of sense to just harsh treatment. Yeah. Absolutely. We'll just do that, for now. And then, yes, we're going to have to boost stability. Can we wait for the core, though? That's 12 administrative points. That's a lot. <laughs> when you only make 5 a month, you've got to be so efficient with these damn points to try to stay ahead. Notice I haven't built, like, a single building. Can't spend monarch points on buildings? That's crazy. We do have diplomats free. And, uh... Oh, Lithuania doesn't like us. Crap. Just in case we die. We're 62. Oh, ooh. Ooh, that would have been bad. Could have been terrible. France, you still like us, right? There goes our recent uprising protection up here. So that just means that these guys are going to rebel again. Again. And it's not even nationalism. It's just... It's just the fact that we... Okay, autonomy decreased. Not too much longer that we'll have issues there. Alright, what do we do next? We... We wait for the core. That's all we do. Once we have the core, we boost stability. That allows us to finish converting this. Polish peasants are now causing problems. Kelmno. These are the Brandenburgian nationalists. Why don't I see them on this list? Whatever. I'm not going to worry about it. Unless they get to like 85%, then we'll pay attention to it. You know there should also be an alert for? There should be an alert that says you have a missionary with 0%. Like, an alert that says, like, missionary unable to convert. Or something. Because I have no idea how long this has been sitting at 97.5%. But that's just creating revolt risk while also costing me money. And there's no way that it can ever... Oh, man. Well, actually, this is fine. We just took the tech level. Any chance that we could uh, hold off on this for a couple months? Maybe take this thing first? Nah, we'll just, we'll just take it now. That will be fine. That means we don't have to spend points. What is going on here? Why is it still 0%? 
At this speed, March 1548. Am I just crazy? Did I add the math up wrong earlier? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 6.1 minus... Oh, okay, it's 6 on the bottom. It should still be 0.1. I must have done the math wrong earlier, but I swear. Alright, fine. Back to plan A. Wait for the core. Boost stability. And then it's just five quick months. Okay, no, that did progress. That progressed by... by point one. It's going by, like, like less than point one. All right, give us a core, please. Pretty please. Wait, what? That wasn't our land, was it? No. I know we didn't give that. Did we? We did. Rabat, you're just wasting my time and then. Don't tell me you're going to have problems with this one, too, are you? Alright, well, let's boost stability now. Now, you better have speed. 0.6, there we go. Austria is no longer a valid rival. Well, fine. Didn't want them as a rival anyway. We'll take the Diplo points, for sure. Do we have Western Arms trade right now? We do? Good. Go ahead and take this then. I think we're going to need to upgrade all these ships pretty soon. What would be the cost to upgrade them all right now? 500 ducats. It's a lot of money, man. And we do have friends. Let's see if we can sell sell the ships at some point in the near future. I want to I want to just get this thing done first. And then, other than that, I think we can actually press the button, can't we? Yep. Yeah. As soon as the as soon as we get that one province converted, I'm gonna. I'm, I don't know why, but I just feel like that's a good thing to wait for. And then, you know what? Actually, I'm wrong. We cannot do it yet. Because we need 280-some points to be able to core this thing. Yeah. So now we're waiting on 280 administrative points. Let's change our focus to administrative, since we took a, a humanist idea group. I know, I really want to click that button, but... Hmm. Just can't do it yet. It'd be a bad idea. Country changes to the Commonwealth. We gain base tax in Kelmno. Why Kelmno? Stetton. You are really uh, some feisty people here. Okay, well, I'm going to take a break here. Um, I guess we're going to do it in the next video. So, thanks for watching, everyone. See you soon.